what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back we're here with some more west world so a um, couple of people asked me what's going to be the schedule for west world on the channel um so let me address this here okay west world is going to be one episode on friday one episode on saturdays and an extra episode will be on early access okay so that's how it's going to be all right so one episode on friday another episode on saturday and then there's going to be an extra episode on early access so if you want to see that extra app the extra episode um please go ahead and sign up for early access on the channel it's not that hard to hit the join button it's only two dollars okay so anyways let's talk about westworld i did episode one i didn't upload any others because i was having trouble with the google drive so um this is episode two you're watching this on friday tomorrow episode three and then episode four will be on early access okay so if you want to see that early of course you know episode four is going to come out on friday of next week okay so that's how it goes all right so thank you guys so much i appreciate you guys for sticking around to our series tremendous support um didn't expect so many people to be watching westworld on the channel of course but it is what it is thank you guys so much for showing up appreciate you guys um if you're new to the channel welcome to the channel if you're here for the westworld reactions i am interested this series is going to be interesting because um i don't know what is going to happen because it seems like it's a world where it seems like these robots are these robots are going to it's they're so lifelike they're like humans so um it seems like they're going to rebel i think they are going to rebel and that issue is going to set in some way somehow i think that's what's going to happen in this series um but it's yet to be seen just watching one episode and understanding you know it seems like these robots they are um learning you know what i'm saying it seems like they're learning what's really going on and you know about these humans you know what i'm saying so um you know let's create a new world anyways it, it you know it, it's just a contrast of stuff that you can draw from this because as i said in the series and then it turns out to be so it's like only rich people would have been able to even afford this you know what i'm saying so i'm pretty sure that this is a world be, you know outside of the scope of the regular world that is going on this is an experience that rich people got to pay to experience they could do whatever they want they could kill these robots they could do whatever they want because they could just rebuild them whatever but it seems like they're learning and catching on to what's really going on there's things that are being revealed to them like that picture that kind of you know what i'm saying and then he was quoted shakespeare and all of this other stuff so we don't know there's a malfunctioning going on and there's a learning there's an artificial intelligence um learning going on here but i could be wrong i only watch one episode so let's jump into episode two and i will see you guys for the review if you still don't know yet how we do things over here let me say it again take a break come back for the review go watch the reaction it's on the google drive go watch it you come back here for the review i really do appreciate people who come back and watch my review because it helps the channel um if you just come to the to the to the uh page and then just go click on the reaction then you don't come back to show your support it doesn't help the channel right and you know you're getting reactions for literally free <laughs> you know what i'm saying i'm doing all everything in my power not to get copyright strike and put my channel in jeopardy and stuff like that. i know it's not the best way to go about things but i do appreciate you guys if you can show some appreciation by coming back and watch my review of the show to keep the watch time up on the channel appreciate you guys thank you so much see you guys for the review once again Right, so that was episode two of Westworld, man. Um, what I have to say about this series is the build-up. 
and the build up is incredible you know what i'm saying and not only just the build up <laughs> you know not only just the build up but the incredible acting that is in this show is just like mm, what's next <laughs> you know what i'm saying it's just like you're wondering what's really going on and and i really don't know what's going on other than the fact that it seems like these robots or hosts as they call them they are slowly seeing the, the truth now with um i don't remember her name but her character is seems like she got a gun now and it seems like it's a real gun so maybe the um the character that ed is ed harris is playing left the gun there that was a real gun buried you know what i'm saying it seems like there's something in the programming that is trying to wake them up and giving them memories and seeing what they've been doing to them so i see a rebellion on the rise that's what i'm seeing the robots you know what i'm saying thinking for themselves and stuff like because they don't shut them down like it's a whole experience like if you are going to be there you can be there overnight so it's a 24 7 kind of situation um with this park which i think that's where they're going wrong running that place 24 7 if i should give my opinion on that i think i think after i, I don't think it should be a 24 7 experience i think you should just run it like any odd like any other theme park you know what i'm saying shut that shit down at night man you know what i'm saying and, and you know reprogram this stuff or whatever you know what i'm saying i don't think it should be a 24 7 situation you know what i mean like because once you're in the world and whatever time you pay for you know you can be there sleep there you know what i'm saying like i think that the fact that they let these hosts live regular lives and every day they get up it seems like it seems like they reset overnight you know what i'm saying for some reason but them talking about dreams you know and they give them dreams as a simulation i can think that you know you know for me and the way how i look at it i think they i think you know they think that they're creating perfection but they're not and then then you have the situation with this world that they've created you know with these hosts in it and you don't really know what they're capable of and every time we think that you know when it comes to technology and you're like what are they really up to because you don't know the really the inner um makings of what technology is actually doing and then when we find out Oh, they've been spying on us this entire time we we're all like oh my god no you know, you know what I'm saying like it doesn't work like that like for me I am not comfortable with with the fact that yes there's a possibility that the government uses our phones to spy on us like I'm not comfortable with it but at the same time I really don't give a shit <laughs> you know what I'm saying I'm just saying like some people they go as far as the oh it's conspiracy theories and all of this other stuff like for me it's just like okay you heard what it said what it said but you can't the thing about it is like you're not supposed to be doing it so who gives a shit you know what i'm saying they can't use any of that stuff against you unless you know what i'm saying unless you know what i'm saying so unless you're doing something really stupid and doing some illegal stuff like terrorism and stuff like that they really can't use any of that stuff against you um and now i'm not saying that they should be doing it and we shouldn't raise hell when they do but don't act surprised the government is always watching okay <laughs> as long as there's going to be technology around and we have these phones and these computers and whatever they're going to be watching you know what i'm saying so you just gotta have to accept the fact that it's never going to change even though you know situations happen and you know you know you got a situation with um what's his name Snowden and all of this other stuff like it, it's you know what I mean like do you really think they shut they shut that down <laughs> like let's be honest did you really think they shut that down because of one whistleblower we all know that what Snowden was talking about was real 
but do, do y'all really believe that they shut that down like let's be honest man like and to me it's just it's just, you just gotta come to a, for me for me i'm not saying you have to but i think for me i've just come to a stage of acceptance with this stuff and just be like yeah they're gonna spy on us whatever <laughs> you know what i'm saying but i know i'm not doing anything you know so off not planning to murder anybody or anything like that or and, it's, and even if you are they're still on a local level like you get what i'm saying it's still on a local level where the the, the police would have to deal with it locally not necessarily like a federal thing where the feds are gonna come get you you know what i'm saying so it's still there's still stages to stuff that we gotta understand and as i said that's just how i feel about it i don't expect everybody to feel the same way about it they shouldn't be doing it but at the same time they are doing it so <laughs> you as an individual can't do anything about it so why complain you know what i'm saying why complain why worry you know what i'm saying you know worry don't do anything complain don't do anything you know what i'm saying uh so at the end of the day i'm loving this series i love where it's where i think it's heading um i don't know what's gonna happen is this guy this this character that ed plays is just he's been going to the park for 30 years because i was a little bit confused after episode one if he was actually real or just a robot but i don't understand why he's just creating this chaos and they're like oh we should stop this guy he's taking out so many of the hosts and they're like no this guy gets whatever he wants okay i don't know what exactly is he looking for this maze that he's looking for in the game i don't know exactly what that maze represents but i guess they're gonna explain that later on in the series we're just two episodes in but in any case guys thank you guys so much for tuning in as always man it's your boy terabyte reacts don't forget to like the video don't forget to comment and i will catch you guys later man peace